Hello and welcome. I'm so glad you're here. Today I'm super excited to share an unboxing video for the March of 2023 Crafty Courtyard kit called Good Times. Pink and Maine is celebrating their birthday this month, so this month's subscription kit is all about birthdays. The Crafty Courtyard kits are a monthly subscription, so if you want to receive a kit in the mail each month, you can join on their website. I will have a link directly to the subscription page in the description box below in case you're interested. They also have a stamp and die set of the month that you can subscribe to. I've been a subscriber to both for several years now, and I just love all of the products that you get in the Crafty Courtyard kits. It really is a wonderful value. Plus, these kits work great with my quarterly card making challenges. If you're not familiar with Kendra's card challenges, I will place a link down below where you can check it out and download the free printable. I also want to mention that if you're watching this video after March of 2023, and if there are any kits left over, you can purchase them from the past subscription boxes page, which I will also link below. Each of the Crafty Courtyard kits come in a bright pink box, packaged neatly with tissue paper, and most of the contents will be in this mesh zippered project pouch, which is really handy to have to place all of your supplies in. It also includes a card that gives a hint of what you can make with the kit on one side, and on the back, it lists all of the kit contents along with the color palette. I usually use these to make an A2 size card by cutting it down a bit and adding a layer of cardstock underneath, and then I attach it to a card base, and then I'll add some embellishments. The bottom of the card gives the hashtag to use if you want to post and share your creations on social media. And I'll show you the paper pad here in just a bit, but the kit includes these glitter enamel dots that match the color palette. And it also comes with this confetti mix. Beautiful colors in here. I just love all the shine. Now this month's kit comes with a bonus item and I'm super excited about this because I just ordered some of the new foils a few days ago and I can't wait to use them. But this is a part of Pink and Main's new foil product line and these are some of the toner printed designs that match the theme of this kit. And you can use these with a laminator or a mink machine and you'll want to use these with heat transfer foils or if you don't have this type of setup. You can leave them black and white and just color them in with your markers. Add some pops of color. This is the stamp set. And as you can see, there are some birthday themed layering stamps. There's also some sentiments. It's your birthday and happy birthday in two different fonts. There's some candles, some little sprinkles for the cupcakes, some presents, a cake. And then it also has these matching dies for each of the stamp images. And it also includes the celebrate word die with the shadow down at the bottom, which is awesome. I love having these just standalone word dies that I can use on other cards. And then it also comes with this embossing folder. I just love this design. It's really different. I haven't seen anything like this before. Um, and then it also has this large stencil. You can use this with pretty much any size card you'd like including five by seven and slimline cards. And then it also comes with some card stock. Now, uh, this pink one here, this one is called dress shop. The orange one is called wildflowers. The green one is called moss. This purple one here is called evening clouds. The blue is called middle school. And the teal is called Lakeside. And it also comes with two sheets of ice rink heavyweight white cardstock. Now let me set all of this aside and I will show you the paper pad. Now the paper pad is called Good Times and it has 24 sheets and they are double sided. The first sheet has this nice striped pattern that has a lot of different colors. And on the back is a tiny polka dot pattern in pink. Then there's the chevron and on the back side more more polka dots in orange larger polka dots in the different colors and another tiny dots pattern on the back in green and then this pattern here with all the colors and then on the back there's some teal tiny dots and then there's this plaid with pink teal and green and on the back more dots in blue 
and then there's some streamers and on the back side there's more dots in purple and then there are these stars in different colors and on the back side is this checkered pattern here in purple then there's this sheet that says celebrate and then on the back another checkered pattern in blue the diagonal stripes and on the back side it has a teal checkered pattern then there's this confetti and a green checkered pattern on the back side and then there's the plaid with the orange checkered pattern on the back then there's this sheet that has the same images that are on the stamp set in the kit in a bunch of different colors with a pink checkered pattern on the back and then it starts over so here is a look at all of the contents of the march of 2023 crafty courtyard kit called good times i can't wait to get started creating some cards with this kit i just love all these fun colors and the celebration images plus all of the other goodies and extras again i have placed a link where you can go subscribe to receive the crafty courtyard kits each month it really is a great value you get tons of stuff I'll be making a set of cards with this kit using Kendra's card challenge number nine. So stay tuned for that video in the next week or so. I hope you'll click on the like button down below and subscribe if you're not already a subscriber. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you have a wonderful day.